Have you ever noticed a notification on Android that just won't go away? When you try to swipe them off screen, they just stick and refuse to be dismissed? I've had this come up time and time again, so today I want to show you a couple of ways that we can remove and hide these notifications from being displayed in our notification panel and lock screen. These are called persistent notifications, and they're added to Android for a few reasons. The main cause for this type of sticky notification is that it allows the application it's associated with to stay running in the background after you have minimized it. Android has a history of killing off background apps to save on performance and battery life, but some applications just need to stay running. In those cases, developers opt for these persistent notifications so the operating system itself is less likely to close it when you don't have the app in the foreground. Another reason some developers and even Android itself show these unswipable notifications is for a reminder. If you've ever booted your phone into safe mode on a Samsung Galaxy smartphone or tablet, then you've likely seen the notification that it creates. This is a great way to remind you that your phone is in a certain state or as a reference for why certain features are no longer accessible. Now the first method of hiding these persistent notifications is by using a feature built into Android itself. We can do this by expanding the notification panel so that you can see all of your notifications and then finding one that cannot be swiped. And then we simply need to perform a long press gesture on one of those notifications. Some phones offer a button that you can tap to turn off notifications for that app. And you can see that is no longer displayed, even though we could not swipe it away. Other phones will use a toggle for this. And this also depends on which version of Android that you're currently using. So even though the application is made to use a persistent notification, we can use that method to hide it from being viewed. Now sadly, this does not work for all of these types of applications. The Android operating system has a few of these that cannot be hidden in this way. In these cases, I recommend using an application called Tidy Panel. It's free to use the basic features. I'll go ahead and link to the Google Play page for this application down in the video description below. But it should be easy for you to find by simply searching for the name Tidy Panel, all one word. Once it has been installed, we simply need to open it up and then go through the setup process. This application does require special access to view your notifications, but the developer has said that none of this data is being collected. The data safety section of the Google Play Store page also says that the information it uses is not shared with any third party person or company. So when this opens up, go ahead and tap on the grant permission option, which should take you to a certain section within the settings page. And from here, we just need to search for the tidy panel app and grant that notification access permission. Then we can go back to the tidy panel application itself. This application is easy to use 
and should display all of your notifications on its home screen in the active notification section. If you don't see one here, but it is displayed right there, go ahead and tap on that refresh button so that it can gather up your notifications. So even though this LS Pose notification cannot be swiped away, we can go into the Tidy Panel app, tap the notification from this active notification section, and then tap on either title, body, or custom text. Go ahead and tap on title so that it uses the LS Posed loaded title for its rule to know to hide that notification from being displayed. We can do this for USB transfer notifications by again tapping on that notification, either tapping on title, body, or custom text. Again, we're going to select title so that it creates the rule specifically for that title. And once it has been added to the hidden notification section, you can see it is no longer visible in our notification panel. The application does have a couple of restrictions. For example, these rules are not going to be saved after the phone reboots, but after you pay for the pro version of the app, then we can tap on the apply on reboot toggle so that these continue to be hidden even after the device has been rebooted. You will also notice that you can only hide a limited number of notifications for free. And if you try to add more, you're going to be instructed to pay for the pro version. And we can buy the pro version by tapping on the support development card here which will bring up the in-app purchase page. So as you saw, Tidy Panel will work even with Android operating system notifications that appear for whenever you're charging the smartphone. And even the annoying Nova Launcher notification that talks about full device access. It will even work on Bitwarden type apps where the notification mentions that it has display over apps permission on your device. These are not allowed to be swiped away or hidden with the traditional method because these notifications are from the Android operating system itself. For now, we have to use third party solutions like Tidy Panel to hide them from view. If you ever want to bring back one of these notifications that have been hidden with the app, then we can do this by going into the Tidy Panel application and then selecting it from the hidden section. Once you tell Tidy Panel to stop hiding one of these notifications, it is unlikely to reappear immediately or even after you have rebooted the smartphone or tablet. Instead, you will see these notifications come back on their own after a certain period of time. 